Dear students of class 7, Assalamu alaikum. Today we will discuss exercise 9.1 that is geometry. Here this geometry is all about triangle. In this chapter first we have to learn some basic. The basic is this sign. This sign always represent triangle. This sign always represent angle and this sign always represent perpendicular listen carefully this sign the both side always represent 90 degree the next and important basic is this in any triangle there is 180 degree so in fact whatever the triangle may be it must contain 180 degree and the last of all in angle sign that means this sign middle letter always represent the angle we will learn it later first we solve question number one in here the question is in triangle ABC since there is a sign of triangle so we have to tell this triangle ABC we have to find the value of this is the sign of angle so we have to find the value of angle cbd and angle abd the last basic what we listen earlier middle letter always represent the angle so in trying in angle cbd here b is the middle angle so this angle represents angle B. Again, this angle also represents angle B. Here, A is the initial point and D is the final point. And here, C is the initial point and D is the final point. So, we have given a triangle here. A, B, C is the triangle. This triangle, A, B, C. We have to find the value of angle C, B, D. Where is C, B, D? C, B, D initial point final point and the angle is B and the another angle is angle A B D angle A B D so we have to find this angle and this angle in this picture or in this question we are given some information like when we go to solution we write in triangle ABC this A B C angle abc is 90 degree where is angle abc a b and c and this is 90 degree since here is the sign of perpendicular and we i told you that in this sign of perpendicular both side represent 90 degree here there is the perpendicular sign and this is a 90 degree that means one right angle so in triangle ABC, angle ABC is 90 degree. This one is 90 degree and this angle, this A angle is given and that is 48 degree. We write angle BAC. That means initial point B, angle A and the final point is C. This two angle is given. Now here BD is perpendicular to AC since this is the perpendicular sign so this side and this side both side represent 90 degree angle so we can write angle adb is equal 90 degree angle adb a d b now if we have to find the angle abd angle a b d in triangle abd we no, there is 180 degree. This angle is 48 degree and this angle is 90 degree. So this angle will be angle ABD is equal 90 degree minus 48 degree. That is 42 degree. How we do that? This one is 90 degree and this one is 48 degree. So this angle must be 90 degree minus 48 degree that is 42 degree again 
to find this angle angle CBD where is CBD CBD we know CBD angle plus ABD angle this two angle if we join we will get this full angle ABC now we write this angle ABD plus angle CBD is equal angle ABC here we find previously angle ABD is equal 42 degree so instead of angle ABD we write 42 degree and this remains same and angle ABC is 90 degree angle ABC is 90 degree since it is given so when we put this 42 degree to this side it will become minus and 90 degree minus 42 degree will be 48 degree so here angle CBD is equal 42 degree hence we find these two angles angle ABD and angle CBD inshallah students we will uh, keep in touch the next class inshallah we will see you with another math assalamu alaikum